So today we shall be starting starting ratio chapter 11 page 95 to 108 and then concentrate on entirely on exercise 11a where we find so many beautiful problems okay so stay tuned while i start my hello everybody you know today we shall be starting exercise 11a exercise 11a and what does it talk about you know it talks about a ratio okay very good now what is this ratio actually try to understand before we talk before we talk about a ratio why not to talk about comparison comparison what comparison for example we have two numbers one is 20 and the other is 15 these are the two numbers now how do we compare so first we compare by the method of subtraction s u p t r a c t i o n how we say that the for example this is a and this is b a is 20 b is 15 therefore we can say that 20 minus 15 is equal to 5 or we can say that a is 5 more than more than b or we can say b is 5 less than a the second method is division the second method is division now what is this division let us again take two numbers one is a other is b your a is for example 20 and your b is 15 b is 15 or you can say it's better why not to take a 10 only first then later on we'll take 15 in order to make you understand in an easy way so we say that when we divide a by b we will get 20 by 10 let us reduce it and you will get 2 so what we say that a is twice b a we can say that a is double b twice b twice b how that that also i'll teach you for example here you have a by b a by b is equal to 2 by 1 so when you cross multiply it cross multi whenever you have equality is better to cross multiply it to get our value in linear form a into 1 is equal to equal to a 2 into b is equal to 2b so we can say that a is twice b very good or we can say that a ratio b is equal to 2 is to 1 a is 2 b is 1 whenever you talk about a ratio you will have to remember only two things what are they whenever you talk about ratio you will have to you will have to remember only two things that the two quantities that the two two quantities should be of number one should be of same kind same kind and secondly they should have same unit so from now onwards whenever you talk about ratio you remember only these two rules that it should be of the same kind and it should be of the same unit if it is if the unit are not same you will have to make their units same okay now let us start exercise 11a number 1 and quickly finish this express each of the following ratio in simplest form 48 48 is to 54 and you are being asked 
to express in simplest form in simplest form so whenever you reduce two numbers 48 and 54 do remember that you will have to reduce into its lowest form okay let us see that they cancel by which number 6 8 times and 6 9 times 54 so we'll write 8 is to 9 do, do not give your answer as 8 by 9 you, instead you give 8 is to 9 because this becomes the fraction do not give your answer in fraction similarly let us take a few more sums like like uh, 200 and 250 200 and 250 let's re reduce it okay 5 4 times 5 5 is, uh, is equal to 4 is to 5 take one more sum let us take one more sum 5 kg and 800 gram 5 5 kg 5 kg ratio 800 gram what do I see here are they of the same kind yes they are of the same kind because they are talking about weight are they of the same unit no they do not have same unit one is in kg other is in gram so we will have to reduce them to the lower you can say convert them to the lower unit so 5 kg by 800 gram will give you 5 into 1000 gram by 800 gram let's cancel let's cancel okay see how it gets cancelled beautifully oh my god very good two how many times two four times and two five times five fives are 25 is to four is your answer similarly you have one hour 45 minutes okay one hour this is number fifth one one hour is to 45 minutes now how many of you do not know that one hour is equal to 60 minutes so one hour here one hour by 45 minutes they are not of the same unit therefore we will convert them in the same unit okay come let's convert so one hour is equal to 60 minute and this 45 minute is already in minute who will cancel you know i will only cancel you cannot cancel 15 how many times 15 four times and 15 three times and this will give you four is to three where is the problem similarly you have two years nine months so two years nine months and you do you know that one year is equal to 12 months we have already I, I hope many of you do not know because you never saw this January, December and February in your school. Okay, staying at home, you might have forgotten everything. Okay, come on. So let's come to number two. So in, in number two, what do we have? A field. This is your field. Okay, this is a field. So naturally, when you talk about a rectangular field, it has length and breadth. So length is equal to 80 meter and breadth is equal to 60 meter. What are they asking? Find the ratio of its width is to length. Okay. Find. Find what? Find width is to length. Okay. I'll find it out. Everything is given. Width is equal to 60 meter and length is equal to how much? 80 meter. Can you cancel here? If I give you, if I tell you that you cancel here only. Can you cancel? Of course, you should you should know to cancel here also. So see, cancel meter meter. Similarly, this zero and zero will get cancelled. Let, uh, let us divide two three times to four times. So I'll get my answer as three is to four. Okay. Do not hesitate that why didn't I divide it? Actually, it is the same thing. State true and false state okay so you cannot state true or false until and unless you solve it equivalent means equal equivalent means equal 
So they say that R the ratio 7 is to 9 equivalent equivalent or equal to 27 is to 21. So let us find 27 is to 21. So 27 by 21 is equal to how much? Let me solve uh, 3, 3, 9 times and 3, 7 times. 7, 9 is to 7, 9 is to 7, 7 is to 9, not equal to 9 is to 7. Therefore, your answer is a big no, it is false. Let us take one more. I will do number. I will do the third part. Okay, you do the remaining one. A ratio of 250 gram and 3 kg and 3 kg is equal to 1 is to 12. You state true or false. T or or F. Let us solve. 20, 250 gram. 250 gm by this 3 kg will be 3 into 1000 gm because they are of not they are not of the same unit i converted them into the same unit let's find if we get 1 is to 12 this gm gm went away 0 0 got cancelled now 25 4 times 100 so here you got get on the top as 1 and while in the denominator you get 12 so you have 1 is to 12 so we'll say yes my dear it is T R U E to ru not to ru true come on number 4 you know in number 4 what we have number 4 is the ratio again the same kind of nonsense come on number 5 number 4 is the ratio 6 gram and 15 gram ratio of 6 gram 6 gram and 15 gram no oh my god this is 5 i'll do 4 later on 6 gram and 15 gram same as same as 36 centimeter and 90 centimeter 36 centimeter and 90 centimeter See, now you do not, do, do not say that these two are of, of different unit. Sorry, these two are of uh, you know, different kind. They are not of different kind. We are talking separately. Each of the ratio is being talked separately. Therefore, this talks about weight. This talks about uh, your length. So, they are, of this, they, these, they are of the same kind. These are, they are of the same kind and they are of the same unit. So come on, if they are of the same kind and same unit, where lies the problem? Just cancel it. So 3, 2 is a 6, 3, 5 is a 15. And here 9, 10 times, or uh, 9, 10 times, and 9, how many times? 4 times. 2, 2 is a 4, 2, 5 is a 10. Oh my god. So of course, 2 is to 5. 2 is to 5 is equal to 2 is to 5. So, I will say yes, they are equal. Okay. Now, number 4. Is the ratio 15 kg and 35 kg same as 16 years and 14 years? And I find that I need to solve this. You solve it yourself. Okay. Come on. Find the ratio between 3 point... Now, number, in number 6. Have a look at number 6. Okay. Find is the ratio... Find the ratio between 3.5 meter, okay, 3.5 meter and 475 centimeter and 2.8 meter. So you have been given three of the three of the values, and they say that please find out their ratio. Please find out the ratio. So what we find that they are of the same kind. Why? Because they are talking about length. They are talking about length. Are they of the same unit? No. They are not of the same unit. Why? Because one is in centimeter, other is in meter. However, we can convert 
meter to centimeter by multiplying meter should be converted to centimeter by multiplying it by 100 so let's multiply 3.5 by 100 so you will get 350 centimeter similarly 475 centimeter similarly 2.8 meter when multiplied by 100 will give you 2 eight zero centimeter okay what i find that now i have the liberty to cancel but whenever you will cancel you will have to cancel it by a single number a single number a single number to all of them so this centimeter gets cancelled very good what about this shall i divide it by five five sevens are thirty five five nine times 45 isn't it 5 5 is at 25 5 5 times 45 25 5 6 are 30 so 70 95 and 56 they will not get cancelled by any other number so we can say that the ratio or the simplest reduced form Okay, or, or reduced, uh, you can say, form in uh, reduced form uh, in the lowest form is 70 is to 95 is to 56. You have been observing that a ratio has no unit. Always remember this. Okay, always remember this that a ratio has no unit. A ratio has no unit. Okay. Don't say why, because you only you only convert them into same unit and then cancel it. Come to number seven. Okay, seven is the last one. So stay tuned. Find the ratio between five dozen and two scores. So ratio. Find the ratio between five dozen, five dozen and two scores. Okay. Now what I find that. We have to convert both of them in the same unit. Same unit. Because they are of the same kind. They are talking about the, they are talking about the number of items. So they are of the same kind. Here we know that one dozen is equal to one dozen is equal to 12 units while one score is equal to 20 units so when you when I would tell you that uh, go and buy one score of bananas means I am telling you to buy 20 units of banana okay so 5 times 12 this will become units similarly 5 2 times 20 will become units okay so let me cancel it okay have a look. 5, 4 times 2. How many times? 2, 6 are. Oh my god. So 2, 3 times 2, 2 times. So we get our answer as 3 is to 2. The ratio between 5 dozen and 2 scores. Next, we shall be dealing with exercise 11b. Exercise 11b. This is for all those who for some one or the other reason do not have good internet facilities and are not able to join the join the online classes thank you my dear stay tuned